Everything here just worries me so much! Fuck, I lost the head again! <laughs> it's not fair! Welcome back, everybody, to Goner. I'm your host for the evening, the Birdman, known as Falcon. If you haven't checked out the first episode, I definitely encourage you to do so. This game is very cryptic, very secret-based. Nothing's really explained to you, and I do a relatively good job explaining what this game is all about with the first video, in case you're a bit lost over here. At least I, I tell you what I do know. Um, this will be our second episode. As I mentioned with the first video as well, if you want this to continue going forward, let me know in the comments down by leaving a like, and we'll continue to play this on the channel because it's a fun roguelite, and I feel like we haven't played a roguelike in a while. So, um, here we're just hanging out with Dead with no head. Excuse me, my friend. Would you mind going over there and grabbing me a head? I prefer the small one, yeah, just because um, it's got 5 HP. Alrighty, so we're all with this one here today. And, you know what? Fuck this laser forever. I, I, I really wanted to enjoy it. Oh, you could hold the laser down. How about that? Maybe this weapon wouldn't be so bad if I just held it down, like every other laser in the world. Why did I think I just shoot ones at a time? This is probably the reason why I failed. Okay, well, you know what? Let's ignore that. I'm still gonna go with the shotgun because I like the shotgun, but... Okay, you know what, laser? Maybe not fuck you forever. I'll give you another try some other time. Um, we had a really good run going on last episode with the first run that we took, and then it kind of, like, we got screwed a little bit, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna take the shark fin. Actually, do I want the shark fin? I kind of want the... Yeah, we'll take the shark fin. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We had a really good run going on with the very first run we did last episode. And then unfortunately we kind of got a little bit boned, and then we never really recovered, I'm going to say. So I'm hoping that today we do a lot better. And we've learned about the enemies in the second world. I feel like that's going to be really important for us to make some really significant progress. Just finding out the enemy patterns! It doesn't matter how many times I fight this guy, I am never going to understand his pattern. I don't know why. Like, I know his gimmick is to just crash down on the floor like he's one of those, like, rock dudes from Mario. I should know his name, but I don't know his name at the moment. Um, but that's his gimmick. That's all he does. Yet still, every single time, he will, like, you know, a 50% chance always hit him. I don't know why. I don't know why. It's so, it's so tricky, the pattern. Like, I'm not sure. I think I just have really terrible reflexes when it comes to him alone. Everybody else, I'm fine, but him. It's kind of like, nah, man, never mind. Um, can you... Damn it. I hate when the purple icons hang out by the exit because you never grab them. You always go into the exit first. Now, I'm not gonna say that's part of the design, but, um, I don't think that should be happening, but maybe it is. Maybe it is. If it's supposed to happen, I don't like it one bit. If it's not supposed to happen, then I hope it gets looked into because I don't like it. <laughs> I want that currency to survive and buy some stuff at the shop. Alright, so... Let's see if we can start getting some combo kills here, because we could use some currency for revivals, as we mentioned, and also items of the shot. That's good. That'll do. Screw you. Excuse me. Patamon, can you um, come down here? Alright, thank you. Yeah. I think it's Patamon. I, th I called him Patamon in the first episode, so I'm assuming it's Patamon. Did we kill enough for a secret bonus exit? No? No? Oh, we did! <laughs> Take me away, my friend. Alright, we have a little bit of a bonus here. So, let's see if we can do a lot better this time than we did last time. So, I'm gonna grab this. I see another currency one. We'll do this. I don't know if you could die in this stage either. Like, from enemy attacks? If Oh, you most definitely can die! Okay, I don't like this at all anymore. Excuse me. Can I please go? Can I leave? I mean, I didn't want to leave just now because I had them all in the area I could kill them, but alright, whatever. So you can't take damage in the bonus levels. Okay. Very good information to know. <laughs> Maybe I don't want to go there anymore either. We'll see. Well, luckily, shotgun is a baller, so it does... Well, we're almost out of ammunition now. <laughs> shotgun, you've been really good with giving me ammo. What's up now, dude? How are you going to do me dirty this way? I just need some ammunition, dude. Alrighty. We might use our ability... <gasps> I am so upset right now. I am so upset, because everything just kind of fell apart. Luckily, we had him enough to revive. I am... <laughs> Did you see that turn of event? I was going to jump on Sonic, and then Sonic realized I was going to jump on him, even though he's never realized it before. He realized at that moment... Can I... I, I just want to... Sir? Like, I, I don't... Yeah, thank you. Um... <laughs> Sonic realized I was going to jump on him, so he waited for the moment I jumped. 
to put the spikes out, which obviously made me lose my head. And then the head landed elsewhere, I ricocheted into an enemy and I died, yeah. What a fucking turn of event. Okay, that's fine. I'm not gonna let that bring me down because you know what, there's a reason why- I don't want to talk about those shots right now. I don't want to talk about anything at the moment, just shut up, don't, don't- I'm a bit riled up, you know, I, I'm- I'm feeling the pressure right now, okay? I'm definitely choking. This is some extreme levels of choking here at the moment. My head's up there, by the way. I realize this. Sonic, you need to fucking die. Okay, here's my head. Okay. Okay, we're under control now. Okay. I <laughs> I was a bit shook. I will admit, I, I got shook. I'm no longer shook. Alright. Hey, I'm um, Currency. You're, you're part of me, so you better drop down eventually, because um, I need you. Ammo? Here we go. Okay. Alright, everything's fine now. We're under control. We're under control. It's a momentary... It's a momentary lapse. Excuse me? No, no. Let me grab you before you disappear. Th those things have a tendency to disappear sometimes. Sometimes they don't, sometimes they do. I'm not sure, so... Not even a risk it. Oh! Oh! I didn't get hit there. That was the ricochet of the shotgun, which is something that I... I've talked about before. Um, here's a problem. You're not gonna suck me to the exit, right? Because I need to grab my items, worm. Thank you. Okay. Ugh, do I even want to kill you? You know what? I don't even want to kill you. Is there another exit? For bonus reasons? Well, we have like six coins. You know what? Screw that. I'm, I'm leaving. I'm just leaving right now. I don't want to talk to you. You and your spiky-headed kind is something I don't want to get involved with here. Okay, so we have six coins of um, purchasable items here. Um, I already have my fin. We're fine over here. A heart would be nice, but I'm not seeing a heart. <laughs> did you did you see how I just asked him for a heart? There was a heart with a question mark momentarily. Um. Well, that brought me no hearts. Ah, here was a heart. For how much? One? I'll take it. And we'll do this again. Now the reason why I'm doing this is because I know if I die with the next fight, I'm not going to have a chance to revive because I don't have enough tokens. Normally every time you revive it costs more and more. And that's about it. We can't do much else anymore. Um, yeah, my clip only holds seven. Alright, so here's the boss fight again. We have the shotgun, which is something that helped us with the boss fight last time. So I think we should be okay this time around, I hope. I was really want to jinx it. Where the hell's my body at? I am so upset right now. So upset right now. You know what the problem is? Like, you lose track of your body so easily. The moment you lose your head, and you turn into a little small blob, like, I'm pretty sure it's not like, you know, oh, it's like, poor design. It's not. It's meant to be that way, it does seem. Like, the moment you lose your head, that blob of yours just kind of get lost in everything else, because it looks so similar to everything in the stage itself, like the enemies and stuff like that, so you lose track of it very, very easily. And when that happens, it's basically you're screwed, because you're looking around like, alright, where's the body at now? Okay, I found the body, where's the head? And by the time you find the head and the body, it's kind of like, oh, well, you've essentially just been killed by something else. Alrighty. Well, that didn't go too well. Let's do it again. It's fine. It's the name of the roguelite, man. You keep going at it until you finally get it right. Okay, now I think what we have to kind of keep in mind here is don't, don't get too shooken up about stuff, you know? And, and second of all, the shotgun, as much as I love it, can indeed be my worst enemy sometimes with the knockback little, um, blowback from the actual shot itself. So we really need to be f in control of what's behind us whenever we shoot it, because that can indeed hurt us quite a bit. Excuse me. I need you. Yeah, thank you. All right. So far, a lot better start here. I think I just needed to get that that first run where we fuck everything up before I could do good. Or do well, I guess, if you want to be more exact about the, the verbiage here. Am I doing good? No, no, you're doing well. It's not doing good, it's doing well. It's like, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean about doing good, doing well, okay? No, no, oh yeah, yeah, never jump on Sonic anymore. <laughs> this guy's learned. He's adapted to my my little jumping method now. Okay. That's cool. I'm gonna slide down over here and just blast everybody to death. How about that? Yeah! Thank you, Sonic. You're the man, Sonic. Alright, you're not the man right now. Okay, get under- Okay. Oh, ho, ho, this is gonna be good! Uh, I just need to get in here somehow. So let's use Shotgun Blast! I'm still alive! I'm still bouncing around! Hoo-hoo! Oh, ho, 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 ho. that was actually very good. 
I think we unlocked the bonus for this one, too. And a lot of currency. Sonic, you're still alive, surprisingly, huh? Mm. Come over here, Patamon. Nope. Patamons? Down below. Okay. Honestly, I don't even care about killing those guys here at the moment. Well, actually, I, I should because I do believe that will unlock the um, bonus stage here. The only problem is... There we go. Get up top. Yeah. Just pinball around. Yeah. Oh my goodness, God. Where did you come from? You're the biggest worm of all time. How do I access you? Oh. There you go. Hey. Hey, buddy. Buddy, I'm right here. I don't want to go to the exit, though. Um... Do you have another opening point or something, or what? You probably do. Do you? Oh, yeah, you do. Okay, cool. That was weird. <laughs> okay. Bonus stage. Remember, you can't die here. We have a lot of currency, though, which is actually really good. So if we die... We should have a significant amount of chances to do better in a future run. You know what? I said screw it. I just wanted to go. Things started to look a little bit rowdy there. Alrighty. Well, hey, we have all the currency in the world here. Now, here's my question. Is there a limit to how much I can carry? E no. No, it keeps going. Okay, so it's um, we're up three lines now. And all the ammunition in the world around us, too. This is actually really, really good. Oh, my God. This is the run I was looking for. Look at that. 619. It's a Rey Mysterio's area code, too. Booyaka, booyaka. 619. Oh, God, God. Rey Mysterio. <laughs> I needed to get that in there. Alrighty. Good. This is looking like a good run. I don't want to jinx it right now, but this this one might be it where we do really good. I don't know. I don't know. The boss fight can be really tricky sometimes. There we go. Alrighty. I think we should have a shop coming up now. We're up to 869. We have a lot of like um, chances to revive ourselves, too. We're at full health. Okay, every, everything's looking really good. Here's laser weapon. Do I want to risk it now? I don't think I do. Alrighty. Well, let me do one reroll just out of curiosity. No, I don't think I want anything in here. I wonder if um, this skull makes it so that my body, or maybe the skull doesn't ricochet too far off after I take a hit? I don't know. I wonder. I need to, I need to really test that skull out, though. Well, for now, we'll do it this way. Okay, please. Oh, we're doing so good, Falcon. Let's not screw it up here, okay? You know what? Let's just use the ability now. My ability didn't really work out. No. Where is the body? Why is the body missing? Okay. Oh, shit! I picked the skull up. I picked it up. I picked up the skull. Okay, here we go. That's, 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 uh, there you go. There you go. The moment you start rushing, Falcon, that's when you shoot. It's, it's simple, really. I don't even know why you're, you're tripping out. There you go. See, the moment they come at you, that's when you shoot. You don't jump before that. Okay. Whew. <laughs> Everything's fine. Almost lost it there for a while. I'm telling you, the hardest thing about the game, I feel, is after you take that initial hit, finding your body from the mess of everything else and then finding the skull. That's the hardest part, I want to say, so far. Everything else is manageable, but that's the, the hardest part here. So, um, excuse me, my friend. Yeah, thank you for the extra clip, and... Aha. Uh -huh. Alrighty. We're at 1221 here at the moment. Pretty good. Let's go to the second world. I'm telling you, this is a run. We had a little bit of a falling out here the first time, but this is good now. And remember... If we see the blow-up head, we're not going to pick it up. Wowee. You guys take a lot of um damage, don't you? How you doing up there, buddy? Yeah. I, I would like to um kill you. Can I jump on your little spinny head, I wonder? Like, is that a possibility? It is. But you blow up soon, right? Ah, <laughs> but you gave me some ammunition before you did that. Very nice. All right. Level two. Oh, right. That's okay. I could play the long distance game too, to some degree. Hey, hey, hey. gonna get mad and blow up. That's cool. Uh, uh, no, 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 not this way. Not this way. <sighs> Fudge. That's fine. You can revive. Alright, this is just humbling me here for a second, you know? I was getting a little bit too ahead of myself, I thought I was doing really good. Remember, you can still die quite easily, Falcon. Screw that shit, though. Alrighty, there. That's done. We got some ammunition here to back us up. Let's use it wisely before we come back and grab it. Maybe even get added to the stage. I mean, we're, we're done now. 
You see this guy? He's gonna blow up there and that'll be it. Oh, see, the ammo does re despawn after a while. That's unfortunate. Alrighty, let's go. Oh, you know what? When you die, you don't get the extra boost size to your clip that you get from that big head. Mmm. Mm, that's a bit of a problem, I guess, but it's a cool. We'll deal. Is this level 3? This might be level 3. I would love to see the boss of the second world just run. At the very least, I want to do that. Everything here just worries me so much! Fuck, I lost the head again! <laughs> it's not fair. It's just not fair. The pits are just the assholes of this game. You lose your head, it's gone for good, then, you know, doesn't matter how much HP you have at that point. High score. I want to check something really quickly here. Can you at least indulge me with, like, I'm 12th place in the world here at the moment? That's good. I'll accept that. You know why I'll accept that? Because, um, the top 10 are, like, mostly developers and dudes, I think. Let's see. Top list here. No, no. Your score. I want to see the, the, the top list of the world. Show me that. There you go. Here's the top 10 here at the moment. Raw Fury, that's one of the, the publishers right there. It's probably Dave or something. We have Diddle, the, the developer of the game's in 5th place. How are you going to tell me the developer of the game's over here in 5th place, huh? We have Key Bladig, Noise, KM, Weird, Weird Lies, Dis, Goof? I have no idea what that says. I'm in 12th place! I will take it! I will definitely take it. Alright, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. If you want to see some more, do let me know in the comments, and I'll continue covering this going forward. Oh, we're so close to the second boss, man. Goddamn. I will catch you next time.